walked in here five minutes ago and we're finished. It's very well organized. The technician who gave me my shot was so good I didn't feel it. And it's recommended for everybody. So, well, Okay, we can go outside. 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 We can go We do the, the uh, division of the uh, Pfizer packs, which come in 195 vials. We divide them to smaller packs of 10, 15, and 50 vials, so it can be shipped even to, to very small point of vaccination. And by doing so, we avoid unnecessary waste of vaccines. This is a very unique process that I, I'm not familiar with anything similar out of Israel. The success of the Israeli vaccination program is that within a matter of three weeks, we were able to vaccinate one and a half million people, about 18% of the Israeli population, including two thirds of the population over the age of 60. And this was done with very little waste in the fact that less than 0.1% of the doses provided had to be destroyed due to cold chain and because of time lapse as uh, uh, required by the manufacturer. So at that point, what we were trying to say is that it is very difficult. One of the key success factors of this vaccination campaign was our ability to reduce fear and vaccine hesitancy by uh, addressing different segments of society with cultural competence and culturally adapted messaging. For just one example, one of the key challenges we had was in the ultra-Orthodox communities, which were very hesitant, and there was a lot of fake news distributed there in, in various means and a lot of scares. What we had to do was to continuously provide scientific information backed up by the best experts. 